Hello. Hiya. What have we got? We've got one of these. Sorry, one of these. Wunderlich. It's a Wunderlich handguard extender for yeah. it's for a BMW adventure thing. Nippy Norman sent it to us, so mm -hmm. in our series of Nippy Norman videos, yeah. this is it. I like this one because this has got the bit over the top and the bit underneath, whereas mine, the old, the Givy ones that I've got, that I got from Nippy Normans, um, didn't have the bottom guard coming there out. There you go. But we fitted one and then we're going to fit the other one and show you how to do it. Come, All you need is four things. Five things, actually. Five things? Five things. The What's guard. that? That's oh, the that's guard. the guard, yeah. Instructions? Yeah, which really aren't that great, to be honest. They're, do we need them? They're pants. No. Don't need them. One of them, one of them, and a smile. <laughs> <laughs> right, so, let's, let's see the one that we fitted, Mark. There you go. First. So, this is the one that we fitted. And you can see that it's this part here that is the extra part. But then when you come down below, it's this bit here as well. So you've got, I don't know, probably about half an inch below that's the extra, extra part. And then you've got probably an inch at the top. But where the BMW one comes down through here, you've actually got this moulded piece that goes right, right around. There you go. And looking from the other side, it doesn't affect your um, lever extension at all. No. It doesn't change the amount of space you've got for your grip. But what it does do is you can see where your hand is, how much more protection you've got on look there. That. I mean, look at that. If that wasn't there, you wouldn't, you would not have very much protection, but with this, you can have We're talking about wind, wind and weather protection. It's not gonna, I mean, if you fall off, it's gonna smash out anyway. Yeah. But. Couldn't be simpler. So how do we fit it? Really simple. Even I could do it. Even I could do it. So using the big one of these. Yeah, I'll hold on to it. Oh God. Okay, we're gonna do that. Yeah. Now the reason that I liked the Givy ones, these are the Wunderlich ones, the black <laughs> ones, mine were the clear ones. The reason that I picked the ones that I bought to start with was that it fitted inside. There are lots and lots of hand guards that you can buy, but lots of them require you... The are the main ones, I suppose. You see them on all dirt bikes, don't Well, the, a lot of the ones that um, are in the same sort of range require you to drill on the, yeah. on the uh, original stuff. Oh, there we go. And I didn't like that. I like something that's nice, neat and tidy. And simple. Yeah, simple is always good, isn't it? Yeah. A few moments later. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Sometime later. Okay, so we'll take that one there. Yeah. You still filming me? Still filming right. you. I'm right. I'm going all this way, all this way. Following oh, you, that following would be amazing. Yeah. Okay, so. They do sell, give you some extra stuff in here, do don't they? You get some extra stuff. You get some <sighs> scrubber shring, whatever that is. Yeah. I'm sure it's just a, a grease that goes inside the uh, Yeah, the and we've pre-used that. We'll pre-use that. You get a longer screw. Where is it? That's the longer screw. If longer I show you the screw. older one. I've just put that down somewhere, haven't I? The older is over there, uh -huh. so you'd have to go and get it. Right, this is the older screw. Okay, so that's the old screw and that's the new screw. Yeah, so quite a little, quite a bit different. And you get the insert. Brilliant, okay. So. This goes on there like that. And it just fits in nicely. Fits in there the like that. The thing that I find different about this one than the Givy one is there is a gap running along through there. So if you turn that that way, there is a gap running through there. Whereas mine, the Givy ones, seem to be really flush. But not that it makes any difference. But you haven't got to drill any of the um, factory fitted stuff. It's only molded plastic, isn't it? So yeah. that goes through there. That clips in there like that. Yeah. Then we present. You like that? I like that. Present. Present. Almost sounds like you do this stuff for a living, Mark. Good Lord. Absolutely not. I have a life. <laughs> <gasps> There's lots of people that do do this stuff for a I living. I know, I know. Influencers they call them, don't they? 
No, lots of people fit stuff to bikes oh, and right. mechanics. I thought and you were things. talking about video channels. Oh, video channels, yeah. There you go. So that clips on there like that. It's just started. Yeah. This then. Oh, haven't got enough hands. It used to be an octopus. <laughs> So the bar, it doesn't change anything. It doesn't change the vibrations on your handlebars no. or anything like that because it uses the same original bar bolt. end weight in there, the same original bolt that All goes that's in. All happened is it's gone inside the original handguard. Yeah. And then all that remains is to tighten it up. Which I'm doing now. Yeah. So tightening it up. Now one thing that I do make make sure or I would make sure is that this is because I'm a little bit anal about things being right so is this at the right height for your oh you, you made me think man yes it is yeah yeah so it's about that right right height and the way that I do that is I come around here <laughs> the way that I do that is just to see where this um, lever goes back so that they both look the same yeah it's just me, some friendly guy on a bike. There we go. So we tighten Lock up this up. bit here. Yeah. There is a torque setting, but it's like, eh, yeah, that's it's what a, I do. It's a, it's, do that again. It's about... Eh. <laughs> that's my torque face. Yeah. There you go. Torque this bit up here. Oh, face. Is that about go. it? Done. And that is done. So from... <laughs> Look, he's so proud of himself. So from here, you can see that it does add quite a bit of body to the uh, the look of it. Yep. I expect it looks quite imposing at the front, but look at the amount of protection that you're going to have for your hands. Happy with that. Yeah, Need really, really good. Need protection for your hands. Yeah. So. so let's come around there because from the side, you can see that it fits around... The, I'm just the, undoing this one because you yeah. said you're a bit funny about how they go. Yeah. I've had to move this one now. Okay. So. And it's just a case of unscrewing the end bit and then just getting it into the right place and then screwing yeah. it back in. It's, it couldn't be a simpler fit. And we've done this in, what, five, ten minutes, if that. And to be fair, we did look at the instruction manual, but it was that rubbish and that's... Not a lot to it though, is well, it? Four it's, things it's, in it, while. it's really bad, isn't it, saying that the instructions are really rubbish, but they really are rubbish. They are not difficult. It is a picture, but I don't, I've never found the instructions... You realise you were waffling on there yeah. as me tightening things up and going, oh, yeah. Well, I've, I've never found the instructions on these Some things right. very good Chinese at all. Chinese ones but, are difficult. I, yeah. can't read it, I can't read Mandarin. But it is a picture. It shows you where stuff has got to go with an arrow. It's really easy, but... To be honest, you don't really need to see it when you offer it offer it up onto there to see what there you go. how it fits. But look at that. Done. Awesome. Okay, who'd have thought the weather would change as badly as this? Now what I want to talk about are these uh, Nippy Norman hand guards which you just watched us fit um, to my bike. These are I'm saying Nippy Normans, they're not, they're Wunderlich hand guards and they were provided to us by Nippy Normans who wanted us to do a review of them. So here they are, they're fitted on the bike. You'll notice that they actually clipped, sort of, into the old ones, the original OEM hand guards that are on there. They just fit behind them, two screws involved. Um, uh, sorry, they give you a screw which is longer than the original one which fits here. And you use the one on the bar end anyway, so that's not, that's not an issue. But I thought, as the weather's so bad now, I'll see what they feel like. And I've got my summer gloves on because it is summer apparently. Although if you look out over Cornwall there, it doesn't look very summery. Summery. Still, still a bit of rain. What's the worst that can happen? So I've put these on. I've found with the original uh, hand guards that my finger the ends of my fingers get cold. Now I, I suffer with that anyway, but I just thought these would give more cover um these are all black toby's got the um the ones fitted on his bike Givy ones i think they are that are um uh at the top end this end over here they are clear so uh these are just a bit different 
So uh, they're not design these handguards like people think for bashing through forests and things like that that's just not what they're about but they are designed to keep the wind off and a bit of the rain so it's as you can see it is raining and uh, I'm gonna see if it does work I've got uh, gloves on that I can feel the wind over my hands it sounds really weird initial impressions are that they do actually stop the wind I mean I know it's not cold but um, it is actually bucketing down, I don't think the camera is going to do it uh, justice. But uh, it is raining quite a lot, and to be honest, these bikes are pretty good anyway for weather protection, but the hands can get a little bit wet. And you know what it's like when you've got your gloves on, you get big soggy hands, and it's, uh, it takes ages for them to dry and all that kind of stuff. So. I'm looking at these now and actually the, the only part that's getting wet at the moment is the knuckle part of my glove now I know the, this video isn't very long and I have been riding for uh, quite a, a, a bit now before I started doing this video so I'm quite pleased with that yep I can feel the, I can feel uh, actually see the wind blowing the, uh, the, the 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 water that's on the front of the thing is actually blowing it over the lip, which is then passing by. It's actually filtering off the end. I put it onto this, so it's actually coming round here if you can see, which I hope you can. That's where the water's coming. But you can see my hands are dry, even though it's peeing it down. So, good! Wonderlick handguards from Nippy Normans. Get a big thumbs up from me. Nippy Normans Wonderlick extended handguards fitted 10 minutes tops. And we'll put the link and stuff in the description. If you like the video, give us a thumbs up. Subscribe somewhere, there'll be stuff, pictures and stuff. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye!